Oh dear, that's a fail. And one of them's come out. Yeah, that one's more or less okay, not perfect. Yep. Focus. Yeah. No, that's, that's made a mess. Obviously made it a little bit too complicated. seems to happen. As soon as you make it a little bit complicated it fails. Hmm. This is another one of those printing sessions that's really frustrating me. I was trying to use up the purple stuff again. It keeps failing. I think that's one, two, three failures in the bin there. There's another one downstairs. I gave up on the purple. I've gone back to the ordinary black PLA. And to be honest, that doesn't sound right to me. You, you get to recognize the sound. moment that sounds okay but the noise it was making when I came in was wrong. Mm. Well we'll see in the morning it's got another th three hours to run yet. Looks like it's printed. It's well stuck down as well. Okay, well, we'll take that downstairs. See what we've got. Mm. That looks a bit funny just there. We'll see. Hi guys, been clearing out my cupboards. I uh, got rid of about, I don't know, 30 or 40 old shirts and similar items. Got a load of coat hangers left over. So I thought I'd see if I could make a bracket to link two of them together. For, um... A rubber band powered car, of course. Had no end of trouble printing because I was still trying to use up that purple PLA plus that I got and it gives me nothing but trouble trying to print with it. Sometimes I get a good run with it, other times I don't. This is about my fourth or fifth attempt to print these brackets. Um, I moved on to black filament because I'd given up on the purple. Black seemed to work all right, except I had to remember all the old settings I've been using for the ordinary PLA. 
so that was going a bit thin and I increased the temperature which is why it went the right colour at the end. I think I caught it just in time otherwise that would have been a waste as well. Anyway I'll get rid of the um, the raft and the support layers and see if we can put this together. Right looks like it'll work. Got my usual 3D printed hubs for the CDs, bamboo canes for the axles, So we'll attach a rubber band or two and see how we go. And a few rubber bands around the back axle or over the top of the back axle, around itself so it holds itself in place. That's probably enough. Camera up. Uh, off we go. Are we going a bit left? We are going a bit left. Close enough. Okay, well, I'll go and put the camera back up at that end and see if we can hit the camera before it goes out the uh, out the window, <laughs> out the door. Definitely drifting a bit left, I'll point it right. So, that works, rubber band powered car, two plastic coat hangers, four CDs, four 3D printed hubs, two bamboo barbecue skewers for the axles, some rubber bands and my 3D printed brackets to match the um, clothes hangers. <laughs>